Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. We're back out today on a lovely afternoon in, I was gonna say August, but it's not August yet. It's July 30th, we're out and it's not that sunny. Uh, it was this morning, it was very, very nice, but it started raining a little bit now, but it is nice because it's still quite hot and the rain is quite refreshing. But we're going out today on a brand new field on a pretty much brand new permission. We've only done one field of theirs before and the grass was super, super long, but we did have a couple really nice bits as well, even with the grass being really long and the ground was like rock as well. But we've got a brand new field over there. It was in a uh, rapeseed uh, crop, so it's stubble. There's obviously cut it down now. But there's quite a few flat bits and areas that we can go in that aren't stubble. Um, but as you know, rape, the other metal detectors here, rapeseed oil is very hard, but I'm sure it'll be fine because we had a little look at it earlier and there's quite a few nice flat bits. So super, super excited. We are near a old Roman kind of area. There's quite a bit of Roman in this, in the surrounding field. So hopefully we're gonna be getting some Roman, some medieval, all sorts today. First proper signal, nice 85, quite clean. I'm on the ultimate program as usual. I'm on 34.4 frequency on the high frequency coil and about 94 sensitivity because I've only been doing it for a couple of minutes, but I can tell the field's really quiet. So I'm gonna whack the sensitivity up to try and get the smaller bits like the Roman coins, which hopefully there'll be some in here. So it's in the mud here somewhere. Is that it? Oh, oh, I thought that could have easily been a Roman coin. Really small little button. Yeah, that's the perfect size for a little Roman minim, but still, I'll take a button on the first hole. Number two, my second signal is quite nice again, about 91, 92, very clean, but quite shallow. But I think the field has been ploughed before, so I'm not really worrying about how deep signals are because lots of things will probably be on the surface, which is always nice because the ground is very, very stony. Just have a look around, there's stones absolutely everywhere, especially just a bit more behind my dad there. But yeah, nice one here. It's just on the edge here, something. Oh, I thought it was a coin, but we have got a nice gold livery button there. So hopefully there's some nice detail. If there is any nice detail uh, or a lot, then I'll do a little close up. But if not, I'll just get a photo, but cool. I'll take that. No rubbish yet. You might notice um, we're on grass now. Yep, yeah, we've had a little bit of a change of scenery. We went around the field for probably about an hour and a half and we thought the stubble is a bit long. It's quite hard to get through on the longer bits where it's not um that there's gaps in it so we thought we're gonna let it die down a bit just get some more rain on it and then hopefully we'll come back later on in the summer and it'll be nice and short so we've come onto one, another local permission where we've got a few pasture fields some small ones and um i'm on the field now where i had my gold ring a while ago that was really really nice and on this field there's lots of modern coins um mainly modern but yeah we've got a couple old ones on here as well and then we've also had a roman coin on one of the fields over there so probably just going to stay on this field uh, where i had the gold ring and just do a bit of coin shooting got my first amazing signal it's in the top here and i reckon it's going to be a coin it's just up here somewhere it's in here a little bit i reckon it's going to be a coin It's not too big as well, which is just perfect. But I bet it'll be a 1p. Just a modern 1p, but hopefully it's an old coin. You never know. Oh, yeah, there it is. I called it. Very green, but yep. Modern 1p, but coin's a coin. So, we had a little bit of an issue with the microphone, so I'm going to have to do a voiceover for the next couple of clips, but I'm just saying, we were still on that field, I had a very good signal here, I was feeling like it was a coin, but yeah, hopefully not a 1p like the last one. So, still very surprised the weather, it was the horrible weather, but still, I had something nice here. It was a coin, and it was actually an old coin, which is quite surprising, it was in fact a George the Third halfpenny. So this coin was either the dates 1806 to 1807. There's a nice non-dug example up there. 
I would have put a picture afterwards, but it was pretty bad condition. So that's it. On to the next. Sorry for that, it was just me waffling on about random nonsense for about two minutes, so I sped it up a little bit, but I got a nice signal here, hoping it was a coin, but it turned out to be a Pepsi bottle cap, but sorry if I'm to do the voice over here, but back to the proper video now. Right guys, so I won the coin competition, so we've come up on the bigger field for about maybe 10-15 minutes at the end, because is chucking down with rain now and my boots are very wet but i've got another signal here on the top field and we're going to try get out a roman coin because we have had one on here before it's that there oh i was gonna say so it's like a bit of metal but that looks like some sort of badge is that an animal almost looks like there's houses there or is it it might be snapped off of something. Oh, some colour on there as well. So it's definitely not too old, but I don't know. So yeah, it looks like there's a lion, some houses, and then it says Wem Wembley. Yeah, so we've got a little Wembley badge with a lion on it. It looks a little bit snapped off, but that's really interesting. I, I like finds like that. Right, I'll take a photo. That is... I'm really happy with that. At the end of the afternoon now, but it was very, very good. We had a couple nice bits, but I just can't believe it's July 30th. It's July 30th today, and it's just not really July weather. This is kind of October, November weather. It's very, very wet. My feet are absolutely soaked with wearing my waterproof boots that are not very waterproof and yeah i'm pretty wet but this was just a short video building up to what is going to come soon i've got an amazing permission coming up it's getting cut and then that's a couple me couple weeks and it's all pasture and it is on some very special grounds and hopefully there's gonna be lots of medieval stuff there and just potentially roman as well it's a bit of everything but like Until then, on a tree. I'll see you all on the next. I'm just sitting here. I got time. It's clear to see. From up here, the world seems small.